day to you on a great day here hello there everyone welcome train, back to bob becomes a legend a so we are back with some more pro even pro evo 2020 of course if i can say the name of the game right and we are at hull city so we've had a good few matches so far in our first few matches since we signed for hull in the christmas january transfer market we of course did leave barnsley who we are now facing so this is going to be a Interesting we match. Us, us up against our former team. Arena. Absolutely picture perfect They're probably going to be in a bit of fear considering the little run we've been on. Three wins in a row. Sure, they might not be in the most exciting games. Gets away but from his opponents. three wins in a row. That's all I need to say. Three wins in which I've scored four goals as well. So I think that deserves a special mention. What the fuck was that pass? Why would you do that? I, I was right there. You should have just passed it easily to me. It's a busy front line. Uh, so, um, while I'm getting frustrated by the stupidity of the AI on this, I uh, will also, as always, ask you to give us a like and a subscribe. Check out those links in the description down below as well. Quality of tackle in the circumstances, it was probably goal saving. Oh, that was nice. That was shit. So, all oh, good little ball. Good little ball through. Good chance. I'd have much preferred the ball to come down to me so I could put the cross in. I'd have done a much better job than they did. Boba. Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. Fuck. Have to say that Caught out by the immediate pass tackle. back to me Stops again. Dead in his tracks. Now it's Evandro. That's a pop. Oh! He's done it. I got lucky with that one there. Went for the far post instead of the near post. Well, you know, Keeper got a hand on it, but luckily it just had enough power. So... This is going really well. It's going really well. The surprising thing is, I did actually, um, in between episodes, go and check the settings. And I was thoroughly surprised to see that I didn't actually turn down the difficulty like I thought I had done. And I am just playing better. So that's, that's fucking awesome news. What a goal. What a goal. So, five goals from four games. No, that's fine. I thought the ball was coming straight to me there. It's totally wrong, but it's half time, so it's all good. So, good goal right right before the whistle for half time. That's going to piss off Barnsley. Make our manager's team talk a whole lot easier as well. So, let's crack on to the second half. Let's see if we can keep this going. Well, that's a not very good start from myself there. Well, one nil may be good enough, so That's a bit better, although it wasn't portion, the greatest of passes, and not, definitely the not the pass I wanted to make, at the very least. Ooh, thought I'd have a bit of a long-range shot. Wasn't the best, wasn't even on target. But I had plenty of time and space, so, you know, why not? So, next one of those, yeah, I need to get them on target. Got made the keeper work for it to be fair which is good but he didn't need to because it wasn't on target I just gave him a little bit of fear bit of fear is good but ideally we want him full on crapping himself and actually having to make saves and that's fact yeah actually having to make saves is what we want doesn't even matter if they're crapping themselves or not we've seen one of those raking noted and improved upon I'm sure Right. So. No. And it's Evandro. Oh, another good shot. Another good chance to score, but it's not able to capitalise. Look at all this space I've got here, though. Oh, it's gone in. The header was straight at the goalkeeper, but it went straight through his arms. 
Two goals. So, so fucking hell. Well, We've moved to Hull there, City and everything is changing. Somehow, now we just can't stop scoring. It really simply encourages more attention of, um, of a, a closer nature. Oh, lovely back heel. Pulling out some silky skills now. Oh, well intercepted. Really alert. Okay. So, we sit forward. so, this looks like it's pretty much the end of the match now. 2-0 against our former club. Got both of the goals. I think we're on for another man of the match performance. And once again, another win for Hull City. So, oh, look at that. That is, that is some lovely stats. They didn't have a single shot. Smashed them on possession and passing. Seven and a half. Has helped during this win. I think we're just about out of time, so many thanks to Jim. So, that was fucking awesome. Let's move on to the next match. Let's see if it's going to go quite as well as that. So, we are on to the second match of this episode. Hopefully, it's going to be a fruitful one. So, start off. It's gone better than a couple of recent kickoffs for me have, where I've ended up just losing the ball straight away. So, that's a good start. The atmosphere's terrific, and kickoff. It's gone fucking well. Just got... Wow, yeah. He tried to pass to me, it looked like. It was a stupid pass. But I managed to win the ball back and get a goal. 3.33 in against Leeds. Another Yorkshire derby. Fucking shit up. So, yeah, so this is uh, the episode of Yorkshire derbies, it seems. Both Barnsley and Leeds. Both of them are going to get their ass whooped. Just to be out Leads to the credit are playing pretty well at the moment. Putting some good pressure on us. We're not really getting many opportunities. Uh, apart from that one, which we absolutely smashed at the beginning to take the lead. And it's but beyond that, yeah, it's been pretty qu quiet game. Thank fuck that did actually go to someone on our team. Oh, what? Oh, he's found him in space. Big chance. Oh, got the shot off, but not able to get it past one of the defenders. A real chance to break. That's the through ball. Okay. Oh, he's not quite able to get onto the end of it. Little interception. So, pretty damn good first half, if you ask me. Uh, we are, of course, 1-0 up. So that is one of the main reasons why I'm going to say it's a good half. Just to make it even better, guess who got the goal? Yeah, boy, Bob Flange. So that is now six goals from five games, I think. I've... No, no, I've got more than that. So I think I've got two in the last game again. Did I? Yeah, it looks like a change of approach. and it Was it only 1-0? No, I think it was only 1-0 in the last... I can't remember, I'm getting confused now. But basically, we're doing really fucking good. We have scored more goals than games we've played. And oh, that should have been another goal there. Oh! My God, I'm just throwing opportunities away now. Two really good opportunities in quick succession to get another goal. Squandered. Absolutely squandered they were. And it's Krasinski. No, home. pass it inside. Why the fuck would you do that? Kiko Casilla gets a, the substitution. So spot on. the AI the compared to Barnsley definitely shit tons better. I believe is a winning formula in that is one part of why I'm doing better. I mean, the team's overall stats were much higher. Uh, I think another big factor is turning the game speed up. Like, you'd have thought that would make it harder, but no, it has definitely made it easier for me. Because it just, it just feels a lot more flowing. It's not all that slow. I had too much time to react. It's a bit more instinctual now. Oh, I couldn't get the ball through. So, still haven't figured out the AI on this. Like, the FIFA Pro Mode. Like, that was pretty easy to figure out fairly quickly, I found. How you, you did have a bit more easy ways to manipulate what they did. Because it's supposed to a generic call for pass 
What the fuck was that, mate? So yeah, instead of a generic call for pass, you do have like the specific call for passes, uh, whether it's a through ball, a pass, uh, or a lob. You can even tell them to shoot. You can actually tell them to take a shot if you want. So nice little touch. Uh, sadly, Pro Evo doesn't have that because it is a bit more of a simulation experience is the best way I can say it. Uh, the fact it doesn't let you actually control the whole team, you can, in this mode, only control your player, not everyone. So it is doing everything it can to make it truly just you controlling and becoming a legend. And no shenanigans, so you can't just like be on a team with someone really fast get them to run down the wing and just pass it into your player to get easy goals every single time you've got to you've got to do more than your standard fifa crappy cheating techniques now we're still looking pretty good in this we're nearly at the end of the match now oh fucking ran into trouble there so yeah i've still not mastered like taking the ball on the run really yeah, I've definitely not mastered uh, like taking the ball on the run yet. I, get, I keep getting really bad touch with that, so I need to get that figured. But we're doing really well. Damn, do they have Pablo Hernandez on the bench all this time. They only brought him on in the 91st minute. Rookie mistake, Leeds. Rookie mistake. That is why you suck. That is a brilliant two-match. Couple of big Yorkshire derbies there for Hull. Barnsley, then Leeds. And we didn't smash them both, but we won them both. That's all that matters at the end of the day. So, once it, another man of the match for the boy, Bob Flange, 7.5. We just, we're doing really good ever since we've gone to Hull. So, I'm not going to jinx it and play another match right now. I am going to call it a day. So, thank you very much for watching, as always. Please do like and subscribe. Check out those videos in the description below. And until the next time, peace.